Hey guys, I don't know if you checked your calendar, but it's been like 191 days since a Nick Cage movie came out. And today, Friday, January 7th, we're breaking that long dry spell with Season of the Witch, which, I'm sorry, is much more important than the 10th day of the effects miss. And oh my goodness, does this movie look like a freaking Nick Cage movie. I'm blocking you though, right? Oh yeah. Okay. Now some of you may not know this about me, but I will see every single Nick Cage movie the day it comes out. And this movie is no exception. Exception. Here's why I love Nick Cage movies. It's because most of the time, about 95% of the time, they're so bad, they're incredibly awesome. And I want to share that experience with you guys. So here's the plan. On Sunday, we're gonna have a live chat online. I'll tweet about the details, so follow me on Twitter if you aren't already. Now we'll talk about other things too, like the YouTube channel and you know tips on YouTube. But the reason for it is to discuss the insanity that's sure to be this Nick Cage movie. So you have until Sunday to watch it. If you haven't done your homework, you're gonna feel real left out. Now look, I can tell some of you right now are like, oh, I don't know, Freddy, I don't like Nick Cage movies. I'm not sure if I'm ready to get my cage rage on. You're still not convinced. Let's take a look at the trailer. Quick, try and guess which one's Nick Cage in this shot. I'll give you a hint. It's the crazy looking one. So we're lighting torches with knives. There's good and evil. There's sweet castles here, and what? Book burning and medieval knights. The only thing's missing really is CG wolves, and you know, oh, oh, you know, never mind. There, there they are. And from behind a wall of flame, we glimpse the insane visage of our hero, Nick Cage himself. There's some chick. I don't know what she's doing there. Whatever. Super intense crossing scene. I am Damon of Blybrook. You'll notice that every other actor in this trailer is using the old English actor voice, but Nick Cage refuses to do so and just uses his regular voice in this time period. I will take the girl, but if she is not what you say, she will not be yours to burn. So this movie is basically the transporter set in medieval times, with the possibility of a witch burning alive at the end. You're not afraid of me. Are you? As a man who's stolen the Declaration of Independence and his Ghost Rider, the answer to that question is, of course, no. I don't know how you see that trailer and not think that this is going to be the most entertaining movie of all time. So, go out and see it. We'll have a live chat this Sunday. Details on my Twitter. And I think this weekend we're all going to have a pretty good time cage raging together.